Hello everyone, in this video, we are going to talk about our next TLE course for this second quarter, which is Exploratory Cookery. And our first topic is Use of Appropriate Kitchen Tools, Equipment, and Paraphernalia with the subject code TLE underscore HECK 7 slash 8 UT dash 0 A dash 1 Are you ready to learn? I hope that you are because this is an interesting topic that you can use in your daily life. Get your aprons ready. So let us begin. Our objectives for this lesson are the following. First, identify the kitchen tools and equipment based on their uses. And second, utilize kitchen tools and equipment in accordance to its function. Food is one of the biggest aspects of any culture of every nation in the world. It is also an undefiable fact that learning how to cook is one of the most important skills a person can have, especially teenagers and young adults. That is why familiarizing oneself with the tools, equipment, and paraphernalia which are used in a kitchen is a must. Any cook should know the proper utilization of the kitchen tools, equipment, and paraphernalia in order to efficiently prepare and cook food. We must be aware that each piece has been designed to accomplish specific job inside the kitchen. The following are the utensils which are considered essential for every kitchen and home cooks. Baster Used in returning some poultry and meat juices into the pan or back to the food. Just like when we're cooking turkey or chicken. Basting brush Also used in the same manner as the baster and are also convenient in buttering the tops of breads upon baking. Cans, bottles, and carton opener are used in opening food packages like tin cans. Such openers are preferably with a smooth operation, comfortable grip, and turning knob. Colanders, or also known as vegetable strainer, is responsible for cleaning vegetables or even straining pasta as well as tin contents. Cutting board is usually made of plastic or wooden board. This is where meat, fish, and vegetables can be cut. Dredger is a tube that is used to shake flour salt and pepper into foods such as meat, poultry, and fish. Sharpening steel is used to sharpening long knives. Double boiler is used to maintain the temperature below the boiling point as well as to keep the food warm without the risk of overcooking. Flipper is used for flipping turning hamburgers and other food items while frying. Garlic press is a tool specifically designed for the sole purpose of pulping garlic. Funnel is used for filling jars and is designed 
into various sizes. Funnels are usually made from stainless steel, aluminum, and plastic. Graters are used for grating, shredding, slicing, and separating foods like carrots, cabbage, and cheese. Handy poultry and roasting tools used in making the lifting of roasted turkey to the serving platter without falling apart a lot easier. Kitchen shears is used for opening food packages, cutting tape or string, as well as removing labels and tags. Pasta spoon, also known as server, is used for transferring cooked pasta to a waiting plate without mess. Potato masher is used for mashing soft cooked vegetables like potatoes, turnips, and carrots. Measuring cups and spoons. Note that measuring cups and spoons have different types in accordance to its function. These are some of the most important items that must be found in the kitchen. These tools must be standardized. These are delicate and precision instruments such as its accuracy is dependent by its careful handling. Some of its kinds is the measuring cup for dry ingredients, measuring cup for liquid ingredients, portion scales which is used for weighing a portion or a serving ranging from 1 ounce to 1 pound. Scoops or dippers are used for measuring serving soft foods such as ice cream. Measuring spoons used for measuring small quantities of ingredients. And the household scale. Unlike the portion scale, this type of scale is used to weigh heavier and larger quantities of ingredients, usually in kilograms. Rotary egg beater is a gear-driven tool that is used for beating a small amount of eggs. Scraper it is a tool made of rubber or silicon used for blending and scraping food from the bowl. Seafood serving tools. These are used for cleaning and removing the shell of its seafood. Serving spoons are small shallow bowl on a handle that are used for serving and preparing food. Serving tongs enables the cook to easily grab and transfer large food items such as poultry and meat portions. Soup ladle is for serving soup and stews as well as on gravy and dessert sauces. Kitchen knives are important for all types of kitchen tasks. These are used for peeling, slicing, and carving foods. Kitchen knives are often referred to as the cook's or the chef's tools. Note that there are different kinds of knives, each with its own specialization. Butcher knife is used for sectioning raw meat, poultry, and fish. A butcher's knife can also be used as a cleaver to separate joints and cut bones. French knife is basically used for chopping, dicing, and mincing food. Roast beef slicer used for slicing thick solid cuts of meat such as roast and ham. Boning knife. It is used for filleting fish as well as removing 
raw meat to its bone. Fruit and salad knife is for preparing vegetable and fruits for salads. Spatula is used for leveling off ingredients when measuring, as well as to spread frosting and sandwich fillings. Citrus knife is specifically designed for sectioning of citrus foods. Its blade is two-sided and is serrated. Paring knife is a type of knife which are short and concave with hollow ground. It is used for peeling and sectioning fruits and vegetables. Spoons are used to spoon liquids, lift foods, and are usually made of stainless steel or plastic. Temperature scales are used for measuring heating intensity. There are varieties of thermometer that can be used for different purposes in food preparation. Two tine fork is for holding meats while slicing as well as for turning solid meat pieces for browning and cooking. Vegetable peeler is for scraping vegetables like potatoes and carrots as well as for peeling fruits. Whisk is for blending, mixing, and whipping eggs. The peeler is made of steel wires that are looped and twisted together, thus forming a handle. Wooden spoons has always been a kitchen essential due to its usefulness. It is made of hardwood. Now, let's go to the cooking equipment. These are more complicated tools. Uh, it may refer to small electrical appliances such as blenders and ovens or large power-operated equipment like refrigerators and freezers. Refrigerator Freezer is an insulated box equipped by a refrigeration unit maintaining the temperature for food storage. This equipment prevents bacterial infections from food. Microwave Oven helps greatly by allowing cooks to prepare foods ahead of time, frozen during slack periods and where cooked or heated quickly on microwave ovens. Blenders are used for chopping, blending, mixing, whipping, grating, and liquefying all kinds of foods. It is also used for making puree. And we have auxiliary equipment like fryers, griddles, broilers, and a coffee maker, commonly used in big establishments. And that ends our video lesson. I hope that you were able to learn something meaningful today. If you have any questions regarding the topic that we have discussed or would like to learn more about other related topics, do comment it down below. Also, don't forget to like and share this video with your friends and family. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Surdi. I hope to see you again in our next lesson in exploratory cookery. Have a great day, everyone.